Hello and welcome to our video, Clutch Control The Basics. Helping you to understand clutch control and the biting point and to help you pull away perfect every time. This is an example of a good pull away. So it's clutch down, select first gear, set the gas, then gently release the clutch to the biting point. Do your observations, release the handbrake, and then slowly release the clutch, a thickness of a pound coin at a time. Don't release the clutch fully until you're at a walking pace. Now let's break this sequence down so you fully understand what to do. So Doug's left me the task of trying to explain to you the clutch and the biting point as simply as possible. So here goes. So the clutch is two plates. One's connected to the engine that's spinning. The other one's connected to the wheels via the gearbox. So as we bring the clutch up to the biting point, like my hands, they start getting closer together until we get to that biting point. Just like my hands, you can hear them rubbing on each other, but the wheels don't move because the handbrake's on. This is the biting point. This is where we need to keep our feet really, really still. Once we've taken the handbrake off, that will allow the wheels to spin very slowly. And as we bring the clutch up more and more, they'll get squeezed together. So eventually they're spinning at the same speed. That's when you can press the gas pedal and drive off down the road and the gas pedal's in control. So let's break down what Ian just said. First of all, I'm gonna to talk to you about the gas pedal. What we need to do is set the gas. We do this by pressing the pedal down about the thickness of a pound coin so the engine is gently humming away. This is usually about 1500 RPM or 1 1.5 on most rev counters. We do this because the engine needs energy to get moving. It's a big lump of metal and it needs help to get started. Without this energy, it is likely to stall or pull away very, very slowly. So now you've set the gas, we need to be able to find the bite with the clutch. To do this, we bring the clutch gently up. It's about halfway in most cars. You'll know you've got it because the back of the car will squat down. The engine noise will change slightly. Once you've got it, keep both feet dead still. So you've now learned to set the gas and find the biting point. And with your feet still, the car is prepared to move. So once you've done your observations and you know it's safe to proceed, what you need to do is release the handbrake and then slowly release the clutch, a thickness of a pound coin at a time until the car reaches about a walking pace and then you can remove your foot from the clutch fully. Okay, so you've now learned to pull away successfully and smoothly, hopefully. So let's give you some hints and tips to make what you've learned even more successful. So first of all is your seating position in the car. You wanna be able to press that clutch pedal all the way down and have a slight bend in your knee. This will stop you from stretching to push the pedal down, give you way more control on that pedal. Next thing, keep the heel of your foot on the floor and pivot from your ankle. This again will give you more control over the pedal and help you move the pedal slowly without stabbing and shocking the pedal up. Just a reminder again, make sure you set that gas pedal. Very, very important. That car needs the energy to get moving. A simple exercise that you can do to help your brain learn where that biting point is and get that muscle memory on where that biting point is, is to ask your instructor or company and driver to, on the side of the road, pull up on the side of the road and just practice setting the gas, getting the biting point, holding those feet, and then just repeat that again. So you just set the gas, get the bite, hold. Set the gas, get the bite, hold, and repeat. So it's gas, bite, hold, repeat. Gas, bite, hold, repeat. Gas, bite, hold, repeat. So now you're good at finding that biting point, it's time to pull away. So once you've done your observations and released the handbrake, the car will start to move very slowly on that biting point. Once it starts moving, lift the clutch up the thickness of a pound coin until you're at about a walking pace and then you can take your foot off the clutch. Now your gas is in full control of the car and you just press that gas and off you go. Thanks for watching our video on basic clutch control. Please let us know below how you got on. Hopefully you found it really helpful. Please like our videos, subscribe to our channel to get all our latest videos first.
Thanks for watching. See you later.